Alrighty, alright, we got a second trailer to Aquaman, and I didn't do a reaction to it, because I didn't really care that much. And when I got home, and I was like, Aquaman, trailer 2, I thought, ooh, yay, there's a second one, now maybe it'll actually get me on board, because the last one really didn't get me on board, I thought it was really generic, really lame, honestly, I was not on board for Aquaman. So, trailer 2 came out, and I was like, yes, and so my baby get me on board, and every trailer was like, like, 7 minutes, like, Nine minutes long, really long reviews, and I was like, "Ooh, maybe this trailer will be like good." And then I thought, "I'm not gonna react to it." I get almost did. And then I saw the runtime for the trailer was five minutes, and I was like, oh, "Who makes a five minute trailer?" So then the trailer was five minutes, so I thought, "I'm I don't I'm not gonna react to it." So I just watched it, and <sighs> no, I'm even less on board now. Okay, right, first off, two things. One, what the heck? Why are we using the crappy costume? Like, the, that's like a joke on the internet, that costume. Why are we using it? It looks awful. It looks terrible. I hate the look of it. It looks so bad. Not the movie. The movie looks bad, but not that, like, terrible. But, oh, God. Oh, right after Venom. Why right after Venom? Right, I guess if it sucks, I'm prepared. This trailer sucked, I'm sorry, it's so, I hated it, it was so boring, it, okay, how does one bore me, I've never been bored in a trailer, I have never watched a trailer and thought, this is boring, like, I'd rather talk about the Mule trailer than talk about the Aquaman trailer, which is like the low budget Clint Eastwood film that I want to see, I don't know if it's going to be R or not, if it is R, I won't see it, but if it is PG-13, I'm going to check it out because it looks really good, but I'd rather talk about that than the extended trailer to Aquaman, and also, yeah, how does a trailer bore me else? <laughs> yeah, this trailer's really boring. Another thing is that it doesn't give you anything. It literally gave me nothing. Like, I think that the first one gave me more plot than this one. Because this one basically, so it has an intro where he's all like, I was, but my mother was a queen. My father was like this, um, he's just like this, uh, lighthouse keeper. And then he like, become, then he's like a baby and he's like, the mom's like, I'm going to, you're going to be so cool. And he's like a little kid, then that's just kind of like an extended part of the first trailer. Then this next part comes up. Basically shows them go walking in the desert, and I was just like, is this a clip? And it just, it's basically a clip. Like, they basically just showed us a portion of the movie, where they like go to this place, and they're like trying to solve everything, and they're trying to like open up this tomb or whatever. I had no idea what was going on. It was so dumb. And, and then... It, the comedy fell flat, like every joke in Justice League. Yeah, no, that trailer sucked. I'm so, like, that scene was just so dumb. And then the trailer sucked. Then it's a directed by James Wan. I was like, okay, now we're doing stuff. And then things happen. Then another clip happens where it shows like an action scene. Like, like don't show your action scenes. Right? Like, show snippets from the action scenes, but don't actually show the scene. Instead, they decided to show the action scene. So now that scene's not gonna be that cool in the movie. But it, like, shows Aquaman, like, running on the top of the buildings. It looked really bad. It looks like it was really shot bad. All the characters look dumb. Mantis looks way too fake. The visual case, this one thing I'm going to say. The CGI and the visuals look like Justice League bad. They look Justice League bad. Which is saying, because I thought Justice League looked awful. And this movie looks really, not the quality, but I mean, like, the way everything, the CGI, everything, this looks really bad. Then it shows this clip where they're, like, Mantis, like, shooting lasers out of his eye and everything's happening. Then we get to the end of the trailer, and it shows, like, all these clips and everything, and yeah, yeah. And then at the end, it shows Aquaman with this epic suit, thinking we're supposed to be excited, except we're not. Because that was one of the things I liked in Justice League, is that it tried to make Aquaman be more edgy, and I think it did better than I could ever do. But great, now we're making Aquaman look like a joke. Good God! Probably not gonna beat Thor on such a... Okay, sorry, for those of you who liked this trailer, whatever. I thought it was bad. I thought that, like, look... I don't care. I don't think this movie is going to be any... I think it's going to be, like, from what I saw from trailer 1 now to trailer 2, it looks just a bit worse. Like, it looks like the action scenes were not thrilling. They're just really shaky, weird, dumb, bad. The comedy fell flat. It looks like Justice League combined with Man of Steel, which is a bad combination. I like Man of Steel. I thought it was okay. I thought Justice League was bad, so I think that that combination is going to fail, and it's going to be bad. I'm not going to be the run to show, whatever. Um, this trailer didn't work for me at all. Honestly, I'm still going to see it because it's Aquaman, but I still don't care that much. Uh, this trailer didn't do anything for me. What do you guys think on this trailer? See you guys next time. Bye! I think we beat the runtime.